A Queensland gas company boss has flown across Australia on a plane burning fuel made from coal. Peter Bond says he could soon produce enough petrol to reduce pump prices by 20%, but the state government hasn't decided whether the process is safe. In the blue sky over the Western Downs, final approach for a groundbreaking flight. It's a fantastic achievement. Um, first time in Australia's history we've been able to uh, create a jet fuel from coal. The equivalent of 20 tonnes from Link Energy's facility near Chinchilla. Here, coal is heated to 1,000 degrees underground. It becomes gas and is then piped to the surface, where it's converted into liquid fuels like Jet A1, diesel and petrol. And it's cheap. We can produce this fuel for about 20 cents a litre, so we could easily drop uh, fuel by 20% easily. That would make the pump price today about $1.20 per litre. The coal that's being turned into gas is about 130 metres underground. For commercial purposes, it could be much deeper, about one kilometre, and all on a property that's owned by Link Energy. Peter Bond says the small footprint helps set it apart from coal seam gas. We actually can run a, an entire um, uh, synthetic fuel plant for 50 years on one or two farms. But he's not allowed to yet. A state government scientific panel is assessing whether underground coal gasification is safe. Say that, uh, that the types of technology can be tested thoroughly before they're moved to a commercialisation stage. Underground coal gasification has the potential to really heavily pollute a local aquifer. Not so, says Peter Bond. He wants to produce five to six billion litres of fuel a year in Queensland. And he wants to do it soon. You can literally become an oil exporter. That's how far you could take it. At Chinchilla, Michael Best, 7 News.